Hi there. Now, when I do online or in-home parties, a lot of times there are guests there who have never tried or even heard of Jamberry wraps. So, as I'm telling them how they work and about how you apply them using heat and pressure to get that watertight seal, one of the questions that I tend to get is, well, so do I need special tools to apply these? My answer is always no. As I'm sure if you're familiar at all with Jamberry wraps, you have been told that you can apply these using an everyday hair dryer as your heat source. That's very, very true. And it's also fine if you're just trying the sample wrap that, that a consultant has sent you, or if you've just got that one sheet of wraps or maybe a half sheet that you won, and you're just checking it out to see if you like them or not. Hair dryer works fine. However, if you're going to be wearing the Jamberry wraps, there is a better way. Our little mini heater. Now, why is the mini heater so much better than the hair dryer that you already have? I mean, why should you have to spend extra money to get what you need to put on something you've already spent money on? Well, first of all, it's not a lot of money. It's actually really, really reasonably priced. You can get the Jamberry Mini Heater for $19. Now, as to why it's better, well, there are a couple reasons. The first of all being this one. What? What'd you say? I'm sorry. Yeah, hair dryers are noisy. Now, if you're sitting there and you're doing your nails with your girls and you're swapping the good gossip and all the latest dirt, how much fun is it going to be to be talking over? I mean, are you willing to run the risk that you're going to get the story wrong? I don't think so. Or what if you're trying to do your nails and the man is sitting there watching the game or NASCAR or heaven forbid, the History Channel. How annoyed is he going to get, and how fast is he going to get there if this is what he's hearing? It's not going to take long before he's yelling into the other room, I don't know what you're doing in there, but I can't hear the TV. Jeff Gordon's about to tell me what I saw on the racetrack already. Ugh. That's a whole different video. Anyway, this little baby right here is an absolutely viable source for your heat. But the Jamberry Mini Heater, on the other hand, well, if you're sitting there doing your nails with your girls, this is what you're going to hear. You won't have a problem getting the whole story over top of this. In addition to that, this sits on the table. You can see the little stand here. Now, with the hair dryer, as you're putting on your nail, you're going to be picking up the hair dryer, switching it on, switching it off, putting it down, putting your wrap on, switching it back on, switching it back off, it's not hands-free. And you kind of need your hands to do your nails, right? Well, with the Jamberry Mini Heater sitting right there on the table, we'll pretend my hand's the table, all you have to do is just hold it in front of the heater, and that's it. It's right there, it's already on, it's already ready to go, and more than one person can share it easily. So there's no reason not to have your girls over for a little gossip and nails and maybe a margarita or two. The other thing is that with the hair dryer, you've got a lot of air coming out of there. I mean, now those wraps aren't very heavy. So I can tell you it has happened to me. You're holding the wrap in front of the hair dryer to heat it up and whoop, there it goes. Not good. The mini heater, on the other hand, yep, your wraps aren't going to blow away. 
And you really kind of want them on your nails rather than stuck to the refrigerator or on the bathroom wall, right? So at $19, there's absolutely no reason you can't have a Jamberry mini heater. A hair dryer works, the mini heater works better. So that's it. That's all I've got to say this time. So until I see you guys later, you keep rocking those wraps. As always, if you have any questions or comments, just leave me a shout down there in the little comment section. I'd love to hear from you guys. Until next time, guys. See ya.